What's up, Fight Fans? This is Kurt DeVille with Counter Punch Boxing News, and I have some new news concerning Joe Joyce, Alexander Usyk, Frank Warren. According to Frank Warren, <clears throat> he says that he's trying to get Usyk and Joe Joyce to possibly sign a two-fight deal of their own. That way, both are kept busy until Fury and Joshua in their rivalry later in 2021. This is Frank Warren quote, we are working on that at the moment. Usyk and Joe Joyce, Warren said, I think the WBO will order that as an interim title fight, so we are working hard to make that happen. <clears throat> the eventual winner of the two fights between Tyson Fury and AJ will have to defend against Joe or Joyce or Usyk or vacate the belt. And he also said that um, he's out of his contract with Matchroom. The only contract he has with Matchroom is that they make the Joshua fight. And this is according to Bob Arum. Otherwise, he is free. So his manager, Mr. Klimas, the same manager as Vasil Lomachenko, and a lot of other fighters that fight for me, I would love to have Usyk a part of my group. So Bob Arum is actually is actually trying to <clears throat> sign Usyk for himself because he understands that Usyk is not that happy of a camper because he didn't get the fight that he wanted, but he knows the bigger good or the greater good or whatnot. For, for him to fight Joe Joyce in a two-fight deal that keeps him busy, so instead of him beating or losing to Usyk, um, to Joe Joyce, he gets to fight him again. But here's the problem with that, okay? Let me counterpunch. If they're trying to make a two-fight deal for interim championship, like some type of tournament, what happens if one wins and then another one wins? What happens if Usyk beats Joe Joyce and then Joe Joyce beats Usyk on the second go-round? That means they got to fight a third time. That's not the point. The point is for them to fight one time. The two fight uh, fights of their own is stupid because two is an even number. So one person could win and the other person could win. So I don't know how that's going to fly. I'm not sure about that. That's according to Frank Warren. However, Usyk is um, up for that. If the WBO orders that fight, I think it should be one fight, okay, to see who is who in the heavyweight division to take the top name of the WBO. That's what I feel. But a two-fight deal concerning these two guys I don't I, I think it's totally unnecessary just to keep them busy that's that's not even the point because it's more risk if one guy wins and then the other guy wins then who the hell who wins the first one it's like well wait a minute I beat him the first time we fought like you know it's shit best uh two out of three you see what I'm saying so I don't I don't really think that's a smart idea I think that's very I, I don't think they're thinking about that like they should have been now, the two-fight deal with Anthony Joshua and Tyson Fury, okay, same shit with them. <clears throat> it's not guaranteed that whoever the winner is going to face is going to face them late 2021 or even early 2022. Why? Because they could have three fights in the making, and they might do those all back-to-back -back because the money's there. It ain't a uh, crackerjack fight like Tyson Fury fought Wilder the first fight and everybody got whatever they got. You know what I'm saying? This is a huge fight. This is like a Mayweather Pacquiao type shit. You know, these are hundreds of millions. These are, look, this is, this fight is a lot different than other fights <clears throat> for a many reasons, okay? And I think that Frank Warren is working hard to get, to keep Usyk busy by giving his fighter, Joe Joyce, uh, a chance to fight the winner. Because either way, see, if Joshua beats Fury, then he still has to deal with Joe Joyce. So Frank Warren's still in the picture. He's still in there because he still has a pony in the show. Whereas if Tyson Fury wins, he wins all the way to all the way together because he's going to go in there and fight Joe Joyce, or he might not do anything. He might fucking retire knowing Tyson Fury. You know, see you later, you big Dawsons, right? And then roll off in the sunset. You know what I'm saying? So. It's very interesting to see these guys uh, go ahead with uh, what they are planning to do, but I think they should find another way. I would love Alexander Usyk to fight Joyce. That's the fight that we're looking at, but <clears throat> I don't think they should fight twice. 
But anyway, you guys tell me what you think of Frank Warren trying to put a two-fight deal together for Alexander Usyk and Joe Joyce. Of course, please subscribe. And you guys been counterpunch. Peace.